Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 3, technically 2 also kind of. Um, so we are still in Edinburgh and today we are off to Edinburgh Zoo. I think we're just going to get some breakfast and then hop in an Uber up there. But I just thought I would show you today's kindness happening calendar. I have pre-prepared today and I have peeled the washi tape off because it is so difficult to do one-handed. Let's show you what it is. So there we go, there is today's hold the door open for someone which is something I do a lot anyway, but it never hurts to make that little extra effort to do something kind. We are now all ready to head out to Edinburgh Zoo and we've just checked the forecast for today and it's actually gonna be about five degrees, a little bit wet, but five degrees, which is gonna feel like summer compared to the last couple of days. So I'm kind of happy about that, to be honest. I was wrong. It is not warmer out here, is it? No. He is still here. I didn't just like, off him. <laughs> but yeah, we are just waiting for our Uber to go to the zoo. And also, fun fact, Carl and I have passes for Painting Zoo and they do like a reciprocal thing with other zoos around the UK, which means we can get into certain zoos once for free. And Edinburgh Zoo is one of them, so bonus. We are just wandering around Edinburgh Zoo and they've got all these little lanterns up for their Christmas event. There's some like clocks up here, tunnel down here somewhere. I might just about to see it. Like, uh, where is my hand going? Here. Yeah, it looks good. Oh my God, there's a volcano. How did we not see that? Hang on. There's a giant lantern volcano right here. Let's get rid of this tree right here so yeah it's cool it's early still like it's just open so it's a little bit quiet but that's nice it means we have lots of space to wander around <laughs> we are currently in the rainbow birds section but we've just spent about an hour looking at the chimpanzees which was amazing chatting to the researchers there there's the birds behind me and they do such an amazing job here they've got a really cool research facility but it's all voluntary the chimps can come and go as they please um, and they've got an amazing space um, and they just seem so happy. It was really nice to see. Um, and we were chatting with one of the researchers, Luke, and he gave us tons of information. He was <laughs> so, so, so good. So yeah, really interesting morning so far. I'm just gonna keep wandering around. Bears always look cuddly. Yeah, yeah. Hello. The next exhibit at Edinburgh Zoo is a wild Steffi and Carl, who are currently, I think, tormenting an otter. Oh. It looks like it. Look at the faces. They, they, oh, oh, they've seen us. They've seen us. Well done, I was usually way back at you. No, I know. It's impressive, that, yeah. We've just got something to eat in Grasslands restaurant. It looks quite cute in here. And I'm going to show you my current food. Everyone's colouring in their mats. <laughs> Lunch is here. So I have a margarita pizza 
Carl and Steffi have both gone for a penne pasta with bolognese, although Carl and I are going to share. And Dave has a venison and game sausage bat, which looks pretty good. With no onion. With no onion, because... I'm weird. Yeah, he ruined it, basically. <laughs> but look how cute my little slice of pizza is. Okay, we're all done eating. And here is Carl's finished penguins. You happy with your penguins? Not finished. <laughs> okay. And Dave's are a bit more psychedelic. You've done better than me, though. You've filled in the whole area, which is... Yeah, he well, only has yeah. a little bit of penguin to finish, but we're being mean and making him leave now. <laughs> we are just about done at... And resume. I say done, we've seen everything now, haven't we? Yep. We think. We didn't see any of the big cats, because they were hiding. I saw a tiger. Yeah, we did see a tiger. We didn't see any lions. We didn't see any Scottish wildcats. I think is what they were called. But all in all, it's been a good day, hasn't it? Yeah. He's uh, busy looking for signs. It says up. Okay, we are, Steffi and Dave have gone ahead to the chimpanzee, so we're just trying to find our way back there. And then obviously we can catch up. I would say Edinburgh Zoo has been a good day. It's been cold and kind of drizzly on and off, but one day of rain isn't gonna kill us, I'm sure. Squirrel. Um, it's a shame we couldn't see the lights. I think that would have been quite cool, like the lantern thing as well. But then I think the animal enclosures are closed for that. So I don't know if that's the point at the zoo either. So yeah, either way, good day. We found the chimpanzee house again. <laughs> so we will go and catch up with Steffi and Dave and see what the plan is from here. Good evening. So I just thought I'd catch up. It's like six o'clock now. We've been back at the flat about two hours since we got back from the zoo. Just kind of chilling out. We've had a couple of drinks. Um, just sort of having a bit of a hide and shelter from the rain, to be honest. And then we are heading out for dinner at the dome later. So I've just come into mine and Carl's bedroom. So I'm going to edit the zoo part of this vlog so that it's all pre-done. And then I can just do a little bit when we get back later. Because I think we also want to have another look around the market as well while it's night time. And yeah, just have a little reach around. I think Steffi was talking about maybe we could get dessert down there as well um, once we've walked off dinner a little bit. So we will see what happens when we head back out. This is the dome where we are having dinner tonight. It's supposed to be incredible inside. So hopefully I can show you some when we get in in a second. We are now finished at the dome which is still gorgeously lit up behind me. It is absolutely insane in there for life. It's stunning. I'm just blown away. It's yeah, it's beautiful. Um food was nice. We I think I showed you actually we mostly all had burgers, but it was pretty good. And you pay a £10 deposit per person. So actually it felt really cheap. Obviously, I mean it was reasonably priced, it was like £16 a burger a, a burger or a burger anyway so it wasn't expensive but because you've already paid ten pound each you basically made it like six pound a burger so i'm actually okay with that <laughs> and i think the plan now is to head down to the christmas markets again have a little look in the dark you know, see it all lit up it's kind of still drizzly but it's stopped heavy raining so hopefully it should be a bit nicer and maybe find some hot drinks what are we looking forward to, Dave? Oh, sorties. Ah. <laughs> Here we go. Hey. Yeah, boy, old man dance. This is some. This is Dave's happy hot toddy dance. <laughs> That's it, I think, for day three of Vlogmas. Carl's made himself a pillow thrown here. I've literally just had to like steal one back. But yeah, we had a sort of walk around the Christmas market at night. They were just shutting up, but they did let us in to grab Dave a hot toddy. 
and I've you had a hot chocolate, didn't you? And I think Steffi had a crepe. And then we just had a nice stroll back. It's actually not been too bad today. Like it's not been as horrendously cold, has it? No. We're not gonna get much out of them because look, phone's in his hand. <laughs> so I'm just gonna finish up editing today's video for you. And then I think we're just gonna crash out, chill. Yep. Probably finish off the bottle of wine that we started earlier. And then get to bed, ready to go home tomorrow. Thank you.